All right, what's good, y'all? Back with another reaction video today. Today we are reacting to Rakeem Boyd from Last Chance U. He ended up getting a D1 offer to uh, Arkansas or Arkansas State, whatever Arkansas. And uh, man, bro, watching him on Last Chance U, I really didn't think he was gonna be that good because Jamal Scott, you know, took some of his carries. So I'm thinking like, oh, Scott, Scott, that dude, you know what I mean? And Kingston Davis, he didn't seem that bad, you know, up until he got cut. But I really thought. I thought Jamal Scott was gonna be that dude, but then when Boyd started going, bro, he was gone. Like, like that dude, nice, bro. He's nice, like legit. But uh, we go watch his Arkansas highlights today. Uh, he probably wait. He probably got another year, and then he'll go into the draft. So that, that's crazy, man. It's, it's it's a blessing to see you know for him. But we'll go ahead and jump into this. One thing about him, bro, he a big back, but he fast, bro. Like, he got burners, bro, for real. Boy got burners. And his speed, not even just, like, out the gate. It's like, once he starts getting down the field, once he started getting down the field, his acceleration not the, not the fastest, but once he's going, He's just break. And then another thing too, bro. His cuts, like out the backfield, his cuts is nice. Like, you know what I'm saying? he's dancing with it. Bro, he run hard. Nice little cut, nice little cut. All right. We're playing against Alabama. We're playing against Bama. That's what I'm talking about, bro. Do your thing. Are they getting blown up, though? Are you doing his thing? doing this thing even though they getting blown out uh oh go 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 see yeah that's the thing too like on the next level everybody faster so i guess he's probably not gonna have as many break breakout runs like that but he still he still got some burst in him See your boy. Oh, I see. That's what I'm talking about, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Hey. Good. Hey, bro, if I'm not reacting, I'm watching, bro. Like, I can appreciate it. I like this B2. It's smooth. This, bro, he got a lot of potential. And then the fact that he about to, this, what, this season probably about to be his uh, senior season. He about to go off. Ain't got no, no, no other option, bro. He about to go off. Mm. That's crazy, bro. Like, it's cool to see, you know, he's playing against. Oh. He playing against the top schools, bro. Like, like real competition. 
I see you, boy. ahead of him bro I think I think he gonna get drafted just off of watching that bro like he not he not like he not a little scrub like he not just a I'm trying to explain it but it's just like when you watch it you actually see the talent you know some running backs you'll watch them and you know they'll put up a lot of yards or whatever or such and such or you'll see like the O-line is really benefiting them a lot but I mean, not saying it's all line wasn't, but it's a lot that you, you see the talent, bro. You see it's a lot that he can do by himself. But it's a lot of potential there, bro. It's a lot, and uh, you know, wishing the best. All them dudes from EMCC and Indy and really all the JUCOs, you know, you know, hope everybody be prosperous and achieve their goals. But uh, if there's anybody else from Last Chance U that y'all know of that has a uh, that's went to a D1 and you know on that road. Uh, and they have a highlight tape out. Uh, just comment below, send it my way, you know what I mean? Comment below. And uh, I'll react to it, bro. I'll get to it as soon as I can. But uh, that's that. Appreciate y'all for watching. Anything football related that you want me to react to, comment below. And uh, I'll get to it as soon as I can, like I said. And uh, I guess that's it. Y'all stay blessed.